The story in Tuesday night's game was Jeremy Hellickson trying to chase the Washington Nationals' fourth no-hitter since moving back to D.C. Although he fell short of this feat, HES making a case to be left deeper into games. Facing a San Diego Padres team who were no-hit by the Dodgers just four days ago, Hellickson started strong. He sat down the first 18 Padres hitters on 79 pitches, with only two truly hard-hit balls. Both happened in back-to-back -back abs in the fifth inning. Hellickson has been a real steal for the Nationals so far this is the fifth starter. This kind of outing only strengthens that argument, but how will Davy Martinez change his approach to the right-hander after this start? More from District on deck The Nats manager has been very quick to the pull Hellickson once he starts facing hitters for the third time. It would be good to see a little more leeway from Martinez, and in the long run it will benefit his bullpen. Something he will need to consider moving forward. Zimmerman returns, does damage after a cautious approach to his recovery from some side soreness. Ryan Zimmerman returned to the lineup. And against lefty Clayton Richard, he had a solid 2-for-4 effort on the night. This raised his average against left-handers to an impressive .314. Zimmerman didn't only catch the eye with his bat in this one. He made an incredible slide to score on Andrew Stevenson's sack fly. Skilly evading the tag of Rafi Lopez, he added to the Nats' lead, and managed to save them from using Sean Doolittle late in this one. Bryce Harper's lumping atop the order a lot of the Nats' hitters are swinging hot bats. Unfortunately Bryce Harper is not one of those players. He was 0 for 4 on the night, but things have been trending the wrong way for a few days now. It's Harper's fourth straight 0 for 4 performance, and HES also hitless in his last 19 abs. Obviously, nobody is concerned about Harper in the long term as one of the most dynamic talents in the game. But this run is something to keep in mind, especially for someone hitting lead off. HE is going to get the most abs of anyone on the team, and if he continues to be hitless, a change will need to be made. This could come as soon as Wednesday's game with the Padres, with another lefty on the mound, where Trey Turner may make the most sense. The Nationals will look for a second sweep in the last three series on Wednesday against the Padres. Joe Gonzalez squares off against rookie Joey Luchasi at the early hour of 9.05 p.m. in what promises to be a tight encounter.